It's very easy to celebrate the people who put out fires. It's much harder to celebrate the people who prevent the fires. Reorgs are disruptive. One of the ways that you can create change is in what you celebrate, the sort of stories and myths that you tell. If you celebrate the person who's working 70 hours a week, they're always in at 10 o'clock at night. This person got divorced and lost their family because they're working so hard and you, you give them a cheer for that. You're sending a very strong signal about what you expect and what's required to get ahead in this company. It's very easy to celebrate the people who put out fires. It's much harder to celebrate the people who prevent the fires. But I can tell you that your company is better off if you have more fire preventers you need some firefighters, always. I've, I've done a lot of it. It's very gratifying. But fire preventers are important too. Be careful what behaviors you reward with promotions and high performance ratings. Whatever you reward, you get more of. And of course, the leader is also constantly on stage and, and under a spotlight, as it were. You want to be deliberate about the culture that you're modeling and how you show up. But what you are indicating is acceptable discourse and what's not acceptable discourse. That's something that leaders should always be running a background thread on. What am I signaling beyond what am I saying?